Hello, who was Jethro in the Bible? Jethro was the father-in-law of Moses and father of Zipporah. Jethro is first mentioned in the Bible in Exodus 2.16 where he is described as a priest of Midian. He is also referred to as Ruel, which could indicate the equivalent of a last name. The name Ruel means friend of God. So the fact that the Bible calls him by his by this name may mean that he was a priest of the Most High God rather than the pagan deity as some have suggested. Many people in the Bible were called by two names such as Jacob, Israel, Genesis thirty five ten. Simon, Peter, Luke 6.14, Matthew Levy, Mark 2.14, Matthew 9.9, 9, and Paul saw Acts 13.9. Sometimes the name change was due to an encounter with God. Other times it may have simply been a second name. In the way that a man named Ben Jones may be called both Ben and Jones. Exodus 2 details the account of Moses' first encounter with Jethro. When Moses was on the run for Pharaoh after having killed an Egyptian, he found himself in Midian by a well. Jethro's seven daughters were shepherd heard this is who came to the well to water their sheep however some men chased the women away and moses came to the defense in gratitude for moses care of his daughters jethro invited him for dinner Over the course of time, Jethro gave his daughter Zipporah to Moses for a wife, and they had two sons, Exodus 2.21, 420. Moses stayed with the Midianites for 40 years until God called him from the burning bush, Exodus 3. Jethro Moses' father-in-law gave him his blessing to return to his people in obedience to God. Exodus 4.18 Jethro is highlighted again in Exodus chapter 18. Moses has sent Sephora and their sons back to Midian rather than take them to Egypt. Perhaps due to the dangers he would face in leading an entire nation out of slavery, Moses clearly trusted Jethro to take good care of his family and use wisdom in knowing when to reunite them. In Egypt, excuse me, in Exodus 18, Jethro brings Sephora and the children to Moses at Sinai. The relationship between Moses and Jethro was always cordial, and Jethro offers some fatherly advice when he sees the overwhelming responsibility facing his son-in-law. Moses takes Jethro's advice on how to delegate authority. Moses listened to his father-in-law and did everything he said. Moses then sends Jethro back to Midian with his blessing. From all we can tell in the Bible, Jethro was a godly man of integrity who played a small part in God's great story of deliverance for the Israelites. He is a good role model 
for in-laws. He offered wise counsel, stepped in to help when needed, and then got out of the way. Thank you. God bless.